For a look at uh, the day's weather, let's get over to Katie. We had a beautiful sunrise this morning. Mm -hmm. The clouds kind of dampened it a little as we got into the later part of the morning, but it's still beautiful up at the mountain temperatures in the low 40s. You can see some snow lingering there, thankfully. I hope it sticks around as we do have more snow tonight and we want to get that base build up. We know that October snow obviously goes away. Or often I should say goes away and November snow we begin to see some of it start to stay so I hope this stuff stays and more is just continued to build us up a beautiful base on top of it for a great ski season and water we need that water supply here are your temperatures at the coast and through the valley just warming into the 50s in Portland and we're not expecting to get too warm today although we're starting the day off cooler than yesterday we're still expecting to at least make it to average overnight temperatures although cooler today are still above average for the year. Here's what we have for the first 11 days, just three days that were below average. This one day yesterday that was, or Friday that was at average, and then all the rest are the red ones that are warmer. That's what's giving us that a little more than four and a quarter degrees above normal for the month. We do have at average days all the way through this week, keeping and maintaining that warmer start to the month. This is the cutoff low that I mentioned, or it's going to be. It's in the process of detaching right through here. This gets us to Tuesday at about 12 o'clock. What we're watching for as we go into Wednesday are the showers to wrap around here as it's being cut off from that main part of the jet stream that could fling some showers up toward us Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. Those behave a little tricky so we have to keep an eye on it at one point it looked like it stayed completely cut off and went swept underneath us now it looks like it sort of gets reabsorbed as it moves back in so we'll keep you updated as that moves through because it will impact our tuesday night into wednesday morning as to whether we have showers or we remain dry for today it's dry to start and light rain this evening mostly dry to the east when we look at the seven day forecast, you'll notice a few less days of rain and a few more days that are likely dry or maybe just a few showers at some point with the temperatures staying just right near. I think the coolest day will be Wednesday. That'll be below average in the low 50s and then plenty of sunshine to head into next week.